Hey there, English teachers! Are you tired of spending countless hours crafting lesson plans, grading essays, and searching for fresh teaching materials? But guess what? Say goodbye to the old school ways and get ready to dive into the future of English education. In this video, I'm about to tell you how you can use ChatGPT to level up your teaching skills. Since ChatGPT was a trending topic recently, I am pretty sure you are familiar with this new AI too. If not, don't worry. Check out our guide to ChatGPT using the link on pinned comment. ChatGPT is a smart computer program designed to understand and generate human-like text based on the input it receives. It can chat with you in a natural way, answer questions, provide information, or even help with creative writing tasks. Let's see how you can use ChatGPT as an English teacher. The first way is teaching English grammar. It's no secret that many students face challenges when learning grammar. Some students find it difficult to grasp and memorize, while others may find it boring. So, why not add some excitement to the grammar learning process? Let's explore how to use ChatGPT to make grammar practice enjoyable and engaging. First, you can use this AI tool to get example sentences for every grammar lesson. For example, I asked ChatGPT to give me example sentences for subject-verb agreement. Look at how ChatGPT gives example sentences with nice explanation. You no longer need to write down these explanations to explain your students in classroom. ChatGPT do the hard work for you. And you can use this AI tool to help students identify grammatical mistakes. Tell your students to ask for a sentence with grammar mistakes from this tool. They can use a prompt like, please provide a sentence with a common grammar mistake. Then ask your students to identify the grammar errors. The purpose is to put theories into practice. As a teacher, you can do this activity in front of your classroom with students. Or you can assign this as a group activity. Either way, you can get engagement from students and make grammar learning fun and effective. And you can use ChatGPT to improve the vocabulary of students. To be fluent, students should have a vast vocabulary. The boring memorizing methods don't work anymore. Use ChatGPT to help students grow their vocabulary. For example, you're teaching the word benevolent. You can ask ChatGPT to generate a good and brief explanation of that word. And you can ask to give synonyms and antonyms to that word. It helps students link the new word to familiar words they already know. And ChatGPT help for English translations. Some students face difficulties understanding and communicating in English. ChatGPT can translate sentences between a student's native language and English. Let's say a student whose native language is Japanese wants to understand an English sentence. They can input the English sentence into ChatGPT, like, translate good morning, have a nice day to Japanese. Then ChatGPT can provide the Japanese translation. Another way to use ChatGPT for English teaching is using it for literature analysis. Let's say a student is studying The Great Gatsby by F. Scott Fitzgerald, a classic American novel. Some elements of the novel, such as the symbolism, can be complex to understand. You can ask students to use ChatGPT to get a brief overview of the novel highlighting essential story points, prominent characters, and key events. That's not all. This amazing AI tools helps you plan your lesson within seconds, write reading passages for students according to their levels, find resources, and get unique ideas to teach in classrooms. It's pretty amazing, isn't it? If you like to read and study more about this, refer our latest blog article about how English teachers can use ChatGPT. The link is in the pinned comment. However, Make sure to use this technology in a responsible and ethical manner. With the right approach, ChatGPT can be a valuable asset to excellence in English language instruction. We hope to see you again in another video like this. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and share this with your friends.